30th of October, 2023. This is Christian College Professor Solange Martinez documenting as legally advised, racketeering, organized crime uh, activities, influence peddling, and persecution of Christians in the United States after they reported children trafficking by high government officials, including but not limited to FDI, F, uh, FBI agents, homeland, uh, homeland security agents, district attorneys, and uh, local, state, and federal courts judges. Thank you for calling the Stockwell Agency, where you're in good hands. Para Español, oprima el ocho. This call will be monitored and recorded. Although your agent's office is not currently available, all state's 24-hour sales and service center is available by choosing one of the following options. To leave a voicemail for your agent, press 1. For all calls relating to claims, press 2. If you are interested in buying insurance or need a quote for a new policy, press 3. For payment and This call may be monitored or recorded for quality assurance or claim purposes. In few words, tell me how I can help you today. Agent. Okay, we have a team of specialized representatives, so I want to handle this the best way possible. You can say things like file a claim or existing claim questions. What specifically do you need help with? How can I help? Agent. Auto agent. Sorry, let's try this another way. If you need help with a claim that's already been started, say existing claim. Otherwise, say new claim or roadside assistance. Customer service. Sorry. To get help with a claim that's already been started, say existing. Let me call back again. Thank you for calling the Stockwell Agency, where you're in good hands. Para Español, oprima el ocho. This call will be monitored and recorded. Although your agent's office is not currently available, all state's 24-hour sales and service center is available by choosing one of the following options. To leave a voicemail for your agent, press 1. For all calls relating to claims, press 2. If you are interested in buying insurance or need a quote for a new policy, press 3. For payment information or to make a payment, press 4. For all other requests or changes on your Allstate insurance, press 5. To repeat these, for rates, discounts, or changes, press 1. For ID cards, proof of insurance, or a copy of your policy, press 2. For agent information, press 3. To report an accident, property loss, or theft, press 4. For billing and all other requests, press 5. To return to the... Okay, let's get started. What's your nine-digit policy number? Recurring payment plan, and we withdraw the minimum amount due from your bank account according to your payment schedule. Your last payment of one hundred fifty dollars and six cents, posted on October twenty third, two thousand twenty three. Would you like me to repeat that? Just say yes or no. No. Now you can say make a payment, recurring payments, billing questions, or help me with something else. Agent. Hands. My name is Nico. May I have your personal last name? This is Solange Martinez, but the name of the policy is Luisa Oyarson, my mother. How may I help you, Solange? How do you spell your name? Nico, N R N for Nancy, I for Igloo, C for Charlie, O for Orange. Oh, Mr. and Miko. Thank you so much, Mr. Miko. Uh. I call You're because um, I have a question. I um, 
uh, had problems with uh, a bank. Well, uh, there is a, a guy who is the chief of police here in Waterbury, Connecticut. His name is Fernando Spagnolo. He's uh, said to be uh, uh, the deep state mafia hitman, and he tried to execute uh, two hits uh, on my mother at her apartment here at 44 Center Street, Waterbury, Connecticut. He also was paid $25,000 uh, separately from the 25 that he received from my mother to kill me. So he tried uh, twice, he failed, and he's very upset. Uh, so he has been following my mother and stalking her around every time she steps uh, a, a foot, uh, she takes uh, a step out of her apartment. From the time that she steps out of her apartment, uh, steps a foot out of her apartment to the time that she comes back. Uh, and uh, he has been contacting all the uh, banks where she banks at and all the merchants where uh, she does, uh, who she does business with and telling her to rip her off. Uh, we had to change bank from uh, Newtown Savings Bank because the manager there in Newtown, uh, Connecticut, uh, Laura Cole was stealing money from her account. She still tries to steal money from her account even though my mother only left one dollar in her account. Now she claims that my mother uh, made a transaction and that she, uh, my mother owns her $55. When uh, in reality, he has uh, stolen more than $100 from my account, which she closed after she stole uh, $53. And then she stole $25 uh, $20 from my mother's account and then $55 from my mother's account. Uh, his friends, she's friends with Fernando Spagnolo, who contacted her. Uh, and apparently somebody uh, made a, a, a charge from all state, according to what we saw in my mother's uh, Newtown, Savings, Newtown Savings Bank account. And uh, the, the amount was for $17. After we saw that, uh, we saw a credit also for $17 uh, from uh, all the state as well. But uh, with the amount of, uh, of money that we saw, the credit was credited uh, to her account but the account said that the money was uh, paid, uh, but it could not be paid because my mother forbade uh, this uh, manager, bank manager, to have overdraft protection in her account. Uh, and you cannot add overdraft protection in somebody's bank account unless they give you permission to do so. Anyways, when my mother added that, um, uh, when my mother got the account, she told her uh, very clearly that she did not want any uh, overdraft protection. And if somebody tries to charge something to her account and there was no money in the account, not to pay it. But according to what we saw, uh, apparently somebody from all state made a charge for $17. But the weird thing is, that uh, the, the, the old state could not do that because we contacted her agent from old state and we also contacted her agent's supervisor and her agent's supervisor's supervisor. Uh, and we also contacted all state customer service and told them to put a note in the account saying that she has a new bank and that uh, uh, she, she also gave them uh, the uh, new bank account number. So it is impossible for, from, uh, uh, for somebody from all state to go into her old bank account when we have given all state uh, her new bank and her new bank account over five times on a recorded, on recorded lines. So we want to uh, get to the bottom of this and uh, find out uh, what's going on because we saw a charge for $17, but the charge should not uh, have been made uh, by all state because all state had the account. We gave the new bank account to all state over five times on recorded lines. So what's going on? Yeah, um, it seems that um, it seems 
like it's a serious matter um i think the one that you should contact about this one is a local agent yes we called the local agent what happened is that because fernando spagnolo contacted his supervisor and probably his supervisor's supervisor uh if the supervisor tells him not to contact her back uh he doesn't call her back so when uh there was another problem with her account we uh, left several messages for her uh agent mr Tre trevor olson and he uh, never called her back first he said that he was um at lunch and we said but we called you at about 10 10 30 in the morning you couldn't be at lunch at 10 30 in the morning he said no i went to lunch at 12 o'clock so we asked why didn't you contact her uh before going to lunch he gave us uh an excuse then we asked why didn't you contact her uh after you came back from lunch because from 12 to 5 is is several hours and then he gave us another excuse the fact is that uh, somebody is making a charge from all states supposedly but the problem with that theory uh is that uh, and the problem that Fernando Spagnolo and Laura, uh, Laura Cole from Newtown Savings Bank have is that we gave all state um, the new bank uh, name and also the new bank account uh, number over five times on recorded lines. So this charge should not have been made. That's why we called you to once again tell you that the new bank is uh, Savings Bank of Danbury, not uh, the uh, Newtown Savings Bank. And to put an, another note on her account, uh, because we're going to give this information again to the news reporters, and they're going to uh, want to find out why somebody from all state is charging, making a charge to her old bank account when we have been given uh, given the new bank account and the new bank's name uh, to all state for more than uh, more than five times on recorded lines, so that's why I called you to find out what's going on, so I can tell this to the news reporters before they contact uh, the new the all state CEO or somebody from all state. Yeah, um, I'm afraid that I won't be able to help you with this one because this is just a um, customer service and I think this is a serious matter. You need to contact a local agent. Yes, the problem with that, Miko, is that when we call the local agent, her local agent, uh, he doesn't call us back because uh, he's hiding something, obviously, because when you somebody calls you back, if you're not hiding anything, you shouldn't be uh, not calling the person back, especially if you are paid to provide a service for uh, your client. In this case, my elderly disabled Christian mother, Luisa Oyarsson. And this started to happen after my elderly disabled Christian mother and myself, being a Christian, reported children trafficking in the United States by high government officials like FBI agents, Homeland Security agents, district attorneys, and local, state, and federal judges. I totally understand how important it is for you. However, I'm not the best person that can help you, so lunch. Well, I don't know what to, we don't know who to call because when we called, uh, Mr. Trevor uh, Olson, he doesn't uh, call us back. Maybe you could try to contact our higher support team. Let me know once you're ready for the number. Okay, perfect. Yes, uh, because Mr. Trevor uh, and uh, the people at her, uh, the office where she uh, got her all state auto policy told her that they were going to take care of her uh, auto policy plus the roadside assistance which is supposed to be seventeen dollars uh, or so every month. So if the the roadside assistant charged her old account after we gave them the new account, something is going on there that we we need to find out about. 
Uh, what is the phone number for uh, the supervising team? Higher support. Yeah, one eight hundred two five five seven eight two eight. One eight hundred two five five seven eight two eight. And this is really strange is because um, the first time that we called the customer service number, the person at the customer service number was able to assist us. And now uh, the person at the customer service number at Old State is unable to assist us, just like uh, at Newtown Savings Bank and at um, the uh, Savings Bank of Danbury and all the other merchants that my mother or I deal with the customer service uh, person is unable to assist us always after uh, Fernando Spagnolo and Lori Caruso and the rest of the Deep State Mafia contacts them. I understand. Again, um, you can try to contact that number because I'm a part that I'm not the best person to help you with those kind of legal matters or serious matters. Okay, what is the name of this team again? Higher support team. Okay, higher support team. Can you transfer me, please? Um, if I'm going to dial that number here on my end, I'm afraid that I'm just going to receive your call again. So you need to dial it on your phone. Okay, thank you so much and God bless you. Thanks for calling Allstate, where you're in good hands. Para Español, o Prima El Ocho. This call will be monitored and recorded. First off, will you need help with claims? Just say yes or no. No. In a few words, tell me why you're calling today. Customer service. I'll need your call reason before I attempt to transfer. Let's try another way. Choosing from one of these five options should help. Please say payments and billing, manage my policy, payments claims, and billing, online help, or get documents. Okay, let's get started. What's your nine digit policy number? Once again, please say, before I put you through to someone who can help, for security, please tell me the month and year of your birth, like March 1974. Hi, this is Solange Martinez. May I have your name, please? My name is Isa. I-S-A-A-C. I-S-A-A-C. A-C. Okay, Mr. Isaac. Thank you so much. Is there an ID number Jeremy, that I, I can should... help you today? Yes. Is it? There... Do you have an ID number that I should I, I can put down or no? Ah, uh, sorry, not ma'am. Oh, okay. I called because uh, my mother has been receiving calls from people supposedly working from all uh, for all state asking for money. Several calls. She also has received uh, emails as well. Uh, she also has a problem with her, her um, bank account and uh, somebody supposedly from all state withdrew $17 from her old bank account after we gave her new bank account several times to all state. So the person uh, that took the money put the money back, uh, the $17 from her old bank account. But the problem with that is that somebody from all state apparently is uh, making charges to an account when my mother had already uh, changed banks and changed accounts and gave 
the uh, new bank and new accounts to her old state agent several times and to her agent's supervisor and to the agent's supervisor supervisor and also to the customer service number so we don't understand why somebody's still uh, taking out money from her old bank account if it's from all state. Oh, okay, definitely. So it's your account or your mom's account, but did you tell it's, me first? It's my mother's auto policy, but I'm on the policy as a driver. And my mother is right here next to me, listening to our conversation and telling me what to say. Perfect. So do you think this would seem not so fraud? Uh, I don't think it's a fraud uh, uh, or anything like that. What I think is that somebody from Allstate was contacted by Fernando Spagnolo, who is a guy who works for the Deep State Mafia, and he's said to be a mafia uh, hitman who tried to execute two hits on my elderly disabled mother after she won a court mafia. case. Yes, after she won a court, a court case for more than half a million dollars against the, the, the Department of Social Services commissioner, and she got a court order ordering him to pay her more than uh, $500,000, then the uh, hit started. Okay, okay. But let me, let me check. So you told me that there was mafia involved in your mother's policy because your mother earned more than $500,000? and then mafia was coming after your mother and that's why you think you're getting charged for an all-state policy no and i'm recording my conversation with you so i can make sure that what i tell you is recorded what i said was that my mother was the victim of two hits attempts by fernando spagnolo who is said to be the mafia hitman the deep state mafia hitman and he tried to kill her twice and myself also after I represented her in a court uh, case against his friend, the Department of Social Services Commissioner, and his friend lost the case. So my mother got a court order for more than half a million dollars that his friend has to pay my mother. And if my mother dies or I die, his friend doesn't have to pay the money. So that's what I'm, uh, I'm saying. And after that, then the problems with all states started. So my question is, why is somebody from all states trying to redraw money from her old bank account when we gave all state uh, new her new bank account more than five times on recorded lines? That's my question. You told me your mom is near you, correct? Yes, she's near me, listening to my conversation with you and, and, telling, and telling me what to say. Hold on. Say hi to Isaac. Hi, hi Isaac. It's me, Luisa Oyalsun. Hello, how are you doing today? I'm fine, thank you. That's it. Uh, I just want to remind you, this call may be monitored and recorded for other purposes. Can I please have a, a phone number listed on that policy? Or do you have the policy number on file? El número de teléfono de aquí, de este que yo le di ahí. 914 619 8362 Your name is? Luisa Oyalson O-Y-A-R-Z and Zebra U N as in Nancy Oyalson Perfect uh, Can you please confirm me with your date of birth? Seven Perfect And lastly, could you please confirm me with the policy number? Let me see. 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 Let me can you tell to my daughter she explained to you everything because I told to her now? Absolutely. I passed the closure. Okay, thank you.
Hello, so, Mr. Uh, right Mr. Now, Isaac. Um, you want to be taking off the automatic payment method. That's what you told me, right? No, that's why I'm recording my conversation with you so I can show everybody what I said. What I did not say was to take her out of auto, her auto policy because it would be convenience for Fernando who has been harassing her and contacting every merchant that she deals with to take her off her auto policy because that way she will not get the $70 discount that she gets if she takes if you take her out of her auto policy. So what the news reporters and I would like to know is why is somebody from uh, all state making charge to uh, an old bank account that she's changed and contacted all state um, about and gave her um, a agent uh, the new bank account and the new bank gave her agents agents uh, her agent supervisor supervisor her new bank account and her new bank and gave the customer service uh, number person her new bank account and new bank. Why is somebody from all states still making a charge to her old bank account? It may not be somebody from all states. It may be the automatic system. So okay. Can you confirm me with the uh, current, the new, the real account number? The, the new bank account ends with uh, 3131, but let me, let me double check and triple check, hold on, because I have a copy of her new bank account. Let's see, double one. Sí, pero que él, él está diciendo que, let me see. Uh, yes, it ends with 3131. And that is the one that I have on file. Okay, that's the one, perfect then. Uh, but still, why would, can you check her uh, roadside assistance? Because Trevor Olston, uh, her agent, told me that he also uh, put her in the roadside assistance. So if he has her new bank account number in her new, in her new uh, bank, uh, her roadside assistance also uh, has to have the same bank account number that she gave uh, Trevor her agent and the customer service number. Can you check for her, please? Okay, but uh, I can see the roadside assistance policy, but let me tell you that this policy is terminated, actually. Why was it terminated, do you know? I can see because of towing with insurance, but uh, if you'd like to transfer you to the roadside assistance main services so they can uh, give you a part a further explanation because right now I just have a little glimpse of why it was terminated and I may not have the greatest and the most accurate information. Okay, perfect. So let me uh, speak with them because it is convenience also for Fernando Spagnolo and his gang to have her not have her roadside assistance because she's elderly and disabled. And if some, something happens to her, she would have to uh, manage herself. But if she has road assistance, she can just call her uh, road assistance number and get her road oh. assistance. And she has paid over uh, six months six more, road, roadside assistance uh, without using her roadside assistance. So they have a lot of money from her and she never used her roadside assistance. So that's an, another question that I would like to ask them and the news reporters also would like to have asked them, why did they terminate her roadside assistance okay. if she didn't uh, terminate her roadside assistance and she paid them a lot of money and never used her roadside assistance? Isaac. Yeah, I totally understand. So please allow me just one moment. I will be able to take uh, your call to the roadside assistance. Okay. Can you give me the number in case that we get disconnected? Uh, if the call gets disconnected, I will definitely make charge that I call you back. Okay. Thank you. You are very welcome. Green, but. Uh, actually, I can see that you, I couldn't transfer it because I need to give you the phone number. Are you ready for the phone number? Yes. It is 
No, dice que no. Okay, so you cannot transfer me? No, I'm sorry, but I cannot transfer you. Okay, uh, uh, Mr. Isaac. Thank you so much and have a blessing rest of the evening. God bless you. Okay, let me call. Sí, porque él dije, no se puede hacer una cosa, entonces lo llamó y dijo que quisieran la otra. Y tampoco se va a poder. Porque si tú estás pagando por tu roster assistant, ¿por qué lo desconectaron? Sí. Yo sé por dónde él va. Él se cree que uno nació ayer porque uno sea cristiano. Es que no trabaja, no tiene un oficio. Entonces se ponen a hacer... The customer service hours are 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Central Time, Monday through Friday, and Saturday, 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. Thank you for calling. We look forward to serving you. 30th of October, 2023. This is Christian College Professor Solange Martinez continuing to document racketeering, Christian persecution, influence peddling, uh, and other organized crime members activities in uh, the stalking and uh, following of elderly disabled Christian Luis Aoyarsun by Fernando Spagnolo, which is uh, said to be the uh, deep state mafia member hitman who tried to execute two hits on elderly disabled Christian Luis Aoyarsun and myself on November 24, 2021, and on uh, February 15, 2022, and he failed. So he continues to try. Uh, so we were legally advised to continue to document his um, criminal activities uh, and persecution until he's caught and processed uh, and brought to justice. Thanks for calling Roadside Assistance from Allstate. For immediate assistance, please download the Allstate Motor Club app to initiate your roadside request. The app is a great way to request services and track the progress of your roadside service in real time. Download the Allstate Motor Club app to schedule your roadside service today. If this is an emergency, please hang up and dial 911. It's easiest to submit a rescue request from your mobile phone. To receive a text message and submit a new request, press 1. Message and data rates may apply. If you're calling about an existing rescue, press 2. For membership questions, press 3. It's easiest to manage your membership online. To receive a text with a link to your account for billing questions, new ID cards, membership materials, and discounts available, press 1. For more options, press 2. Message and data rates, great. Here is what else I can help you with. New ID cards, press 1. To cancel membership, press 2. For billing, press 3. To find out about membership discounts, press 4. All other questions, press 5. Please hold while we transfer your call. Just so you know, we may monitor or record this call. We're sorry, but our member services office is closed. For help with discounts, travel needs, or to make a payment, please visit allstatemotorclub.com. How can I assist you today? Good evening. Uh, who am I speaking with? This is Abby Sheikh. Uh, can you spell your name? Um, English is my second language, and I need to know the spelling of your name to pronounce it. A B I S H A G. A B I. What else? S H A G. Oh, Abby Shack. Thank you so much, Miss Abishay. Oh, Abishay. Thank you so much, Miss Abishay. Yes. Um, I called uh, because I have a question regarding uh, uh, the roadside assistance that I purchased. 
Okay. Yes, my question is, why uh, is the roadside assistance at, um, taking money out of my old bank account when uh, the old state agent was given the the one that gave us the roadside assistance when he was given the new bank account and the new bank uh, name why is uh all state taking more roadside assistance taking money out of the old bank account when we changed the bank account and gave them the new bank account number and the new bank over five times on a recorded line we don't understand Okay, could I place you on a brief forty two minutes for while I get some information on that for you, please? I'm sorry, I don't want I don't hear you. Uh, can you say that one more time? Mm -hmm. Could I place you on a brief one to two minutes hold while I check up it while I get some information for you? Okay, thank you so much. I will I will wait. Okay. When they do this, it's because the uh, a, a Deep State Mafia member that has this phone number uh, needs to be given an alarm uh, to sh tell them that uh, we are on the phone and they need to know what to say to the uh, Deep State Mafia victim uh, that has been uh, the victim of uh, account tampering. In this case, the turning off of the roadside assistance for this elderly disabled chronically ill epileptic uh, person that purchased this all state policy. Hello, are you still there? Yes. Thank you for patiently holding. So that question that you asked, you have you have to ask number services that question. So what I can do for you is provide you with number services number and you can give them a call tomorrow morning around 8, 30, 9 o'clock, okay? Yes, uh, but why can't you assist me right now? Don't you have access to the computer for the members? I do not have access to member services. I have access to roadside assistance. Oh, and what what do you actually do, so I can understand better? I dispatch services. Like if you need a tow service, I help you get the tow service. Okay. Uh, is it possible uh, to tell me why my roadside assistance was disconnected when uh, I have paid over uh, six months worth of roadside assistance without using it once? That question, that question is for member services, so I am willing to give you the number. You can call them tomorrow morning, okay? Oh, okay. So what is the member services number for roadside assistance? Are you ready for it? Yes. 877 710 Nine six. Nine six. Okay. Yes. Uh, okay. Thank you so much. At what time uh, are you? Are they working? From what time to what time? Around eight thirty to nine a.m. You can start calling them around that time. Oh, eight thirty to nine a.m. Yes. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay, and now they gave us three different phone numbers for roadside assistance. Uh, which one would be the <laughs> the real one? Oh, brother, let me see. This is supposed to be the roadside assistance. This is the let me see. Eighty eighty. The agent. Her agent's number. Uh, Thirtieth of October, twenty twenty-three. This is Christian College Professor Solange Martinez, documenting Fernando's Bagnolo 
uh, and his persecutions against Christians, uh, in this case, elderly disabled citizen Luisa Oyarzun, my mother and myself, Professor Solange Martinez. Uh, as legally advised, I was um, trying to document that he contacts uh, all the banks and all the merchants uh, that my elderly disabled mother deals with and tell her to rip her off. Uh, so I was told to document this and this is what I'm doing right now. Let's see. Thank you for calling the Stockwell Agency, where you're in good hands. Para right. Español, oprima el ocho. This call will be monitored and recorded. Although your agent's office is not currently available, all state's 24-hour sales and service center is available by choosing one of the following options. To leave a voicemail for your agent, press 1. For all calls relating to claims, Hello, you've reached the Stockwell Agency and Allstate Insurance. We are either on the phone or with a client. However, your call is important to us, so if you leave your name and number after the tone, we'll return your call as soon as possible. Thank you. Hi, good evening. This is Christian College Professor Solange Martinez. I had to call you uh, as per my mother's request again to let you know that somebody did not uh, enter my mother's new bank account in her roadside assistance and the roadside assistance uh, has been suspended i went inside their website and they the website says that she has never been registered for uh, roadside assistance so i was wondering who she was paying the uh, $17 for six months, uh, every month, electronically, uh, and uh, why she has not uh, been told of recording time left. Uh, about this problem. Her number is 914-619-8362, 914-619-8362. Thank you. To send your message, press 1. To send your message as urgent, press 2. To re-record your message, thanks. Your message was sent. Thanks, Thanks for calling Allstate. October 31st, 2023. This is Christian College Professor Solange Martinez documenting racketeering and fraud. Thanks for calling roadside assistance from Allstate. For immediate assistance, Please download the Allstate Motor Club app to initiate your roadside request. The app is a great way to request services and track the progress of your roadside service in real time. Download the Allstate Motor Club app to schedule your roadside service today. But it's a council membership. We can request the service, but you have to pay for it. Okay. Uh, it was cancelled, but we didn't cancel it. Who cancelled it? Um, let me check here very quickly. Well, may I have your first and last name, please, once again? Solange Martinez. Hello? Solange Martinez. Esa sin Sam O L A N G E. Lange Martinez, right? Uh-huh. Right. One second. What is the model, model of the vehicle? It's a Toyota Corolla 1995. Right, the system is not telling me anything yet, so it seems that you have coverage on launch cartoons. Yeah, I see it here. Uh, Jumpstar. Perfect. Because this is a Jumpstar, we will need you to be with the vehicle when the provider arrives, okay? Okay. 
uh, uh, can you give me the um, the roster assistance uh, number so when somebody comes, I know that I can give uh, the person the number? Well, when you receive a text message, it's going to be receiving the provider's phone number so you can call them directly. Okay, and also, can I have the uh, roadside assistance uh, reference number so I can have it with me? Yes. Yeah. Uh, let me ask you, when you try to start your vehicle, do your gauges and dash light up? Uh, what do you mean? When you try to start the vehicle, the gauges and dash light up? Uh, I don't know what you're referring to, but when I try to start the vehicle, uh, everything is fine. It just uh, actually doesn't start. It, okay. it, it, it sounds yeah. like it's going to start, but it doesn't start. All right. Will the provider be able to park next to you? I'm sorry? Will the provider be able to park next to you? Uh, uh, you have to put the microphone closer to your uh, lips because I, ca I cannot hear you. My bad. Will the provider be able to park next to you? Oh, of course, yes. All right. So where is the vehicle located at? In front of 14 Central C-E-N-T-R-A-L Street. 14, 10, 12. 14 Central, C as in Cat, E as in oh, Edward, Central Street. I'm sorry, Central okay. Avenue. 14 Central okay. Avenue, Waterbury, Connecticut, 06702. Central Avenue, 14 Central Avenue, in what city? Waterbury, Connecticut, where I live. Waterbury, Connecticut, where I right, live. Yeah, I see here. I see it here. 14 Central Avenue, Waterbury, Connecticut, 06702. Correct. All right, would you, would you like me to send you a text message with the service provider's information, including phone number and this committee time travel? Excellent, yes. Perfect. It's going to be sent to the 914-619-8362. Perfect. Right, may we share your content location information with the service providers so they can provide your and assistance? I don't understand what you're saying. Do we have permission to share your content location information with the provider? Oh yes, of course. All right, may I know the color of the vehicle? It's a TAN, Toyota Corolla 1995 TAN. TAN, that's the color? Tan, T as in Tom, uh, A as in Apple, N as in Nancy. Tan is like golden. Color tan. Oh, got it. All right. That's all the information needed. I'll be creating the request now, and you'll be receiving the notification on the ones that provided us at the service. Let me give you the reference number. You ready? Yes. It is 0054 418. Eight two four. Zero zero five four four one eight eight two four. Yes. That's the provider's phone number. That's the reference number. The oh. provider's phone number yes. will be given on the notification. Oh, okay. So the provider's phone number would be on the no notification. I have another question. Uh, whenever I want to go online to uh, get information for my roadside assistance, uh, where do I have to go? Is it www.roadsideassistance.com or www.allstate.com? Mm, right. Allstate.com is a, a better place to get that information. Yeah. Okay. And when the... Uh, <coughs> Excuse me. When uh, the the web asks me for information to enter to get my information about my roadside assistance, 
what numbers do I need to enter? Because I tried entering the all state policy numbers and uh, it did not, it said that it, it didn't register that. Got it. Well, I do believe that that's happening to you, but honestly, I, I didn't have like uh, enough information for that. In this department, we only handle light rows at assistance. Oh, okay. So the next time I call for roadside assistance, I just have to call this uh, phone number yeah. and say, uh, yeah. I need roadside assistance and uh, yeah. give them uh, uh, my this number that you gave me, the reference number for my roadside assistance, 0054-418. No. no? What That's number? Our reference I... number for only this service. Uh, do you have to give this policy number that I have here? You ready? Oh yes, I'm ready. It is nine eight four five one four seven eight eight. Seven eight eight. That's the policy number. For roadside assistance. Yeah, for your vehicle or your the account information for roadside assistance. Yeah. Assistance. Okay. I'm looking at my uh, all state policy number. My all state policy number has a different number that starts with a five. How come you guys don't make it simple and use the same policy number, all state policy number for your policy number, the roadside assistance number? So it would be simpler. Uh, you're right. But actually, uh, I'll be more than happy to see you with that if I have the tools. But unfortunately, it, it is not like in this department. Oh, okay. Um, let me do this. Instead of um, requesting the roadside assistance now, let me see if my friend who lives here, right here, um, in the next uh, near the uh, vehicle, can come and give me a jump. If I need roadside assistance, then I'll call you back. So then you, you don't want me to create the request now? Uh, if you create the request, the roadside assistance person is going to come within uh, an hour or so. Uh, usually it's within 30 minutes, half an hour. So mm -hmm. it's better if I call my friend and he uh, tries to okay. uh, start the car because that way uh, the, the, you, they don't I have understand. to come. You want to make sure that your friend can help you. And if not, you are going to be coming in a Exactly. Get the service. Okay. All right. Yeah, sure. I understand. I'm going to be, well, you call us back with this reference number. And with that reference number, uh, we can create, you know, this much immediately. It's all the information already, already like added. So it's okay. Okay. So I, when I call, I just give them the uh, roadside assistance number. number. Yeah. And then uh, I will give them the reference number as well. Yeah, Sally. Okay, thank you so much. What, what's your name, honey? My name is Efrain. E-F-R-A-A-N, Efrain. Efrain. I think that's from the Bible, Efrain. You have a pleasant rest of the night. Yeah. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. Bye-bye. Have a good night also. Thank you. Bye-bye, take care.